He's crook. Patney. Rosario is in the middle. Up comes Dale Gordon. Oh, he struck it well. Fine strike. And he thought it was worth the corner. But he's not to get it. They've got caught a bit. Gordon had quite a distance to make. Sheedy was the player who came across. There was only one option. And I must say, I think Dale Gordon is right that he should have got a corner. Seemed to me to get two deflections. The first off Sheedy, the second off Southall. It's an Everton throw. Bracewell. Crook thought for a moment he'd escaped, but the little fellow was there, and among a few whirling legs, he managed to get the one which counted. Goalkeeper going one way, back off the angle. Sharp comes again off Crook. Bowen comes off the back line, and it's Nevin who has scored for Everton. So steady from behind the goal. Sheedy, who got the touch there, came back off the post, in fact. And Johnny on the spot was, in fact, called Patrick. Into the last five minutes of the first half. Townsend! And Neville Southall just watched it go by. The only muscles that moved from the goalkeeper were those in his eyes. Rosario winning in the air again, but there's always cover behind. Bowen. It's well up by Ratcliffe. Acrobatic attempt by Malcolm Allen. Certainly got his instep all round it. Teasing little ball from Mark Allen, uh, from um, Bowen and Markham Allen with the instep, but Southall right in line. <laughs> Sheedy. Cutty! Good stop. Met it very solidly, Tony Cutty. Brown Gunn keeping Norwich in the cup. Fox got to find the right cross. Rosario, Crook! Well, brief highlights there of how Everton got through to this year's FA Cup final. It'll be their fourth of the 80s, which is a, a tremendous...